probably familiar with this. Uh, it's a great, great take on the original Lenny. Has a great neck on it. Some folks have asked about the neck. My favorite neck, just have to tell you, is uh, the early 60s necks that are on the, uh, the Stratocasters. And I just honestly don't like the, the really big necks. I also like a 57V. Is a, is in Eric Clapton. If you like the Peach 7 v and you're good company because Eric Clapton, that's his favorite neck. And this is kind of, you know, it reminds me of both necks. It's almost like a combination. It just doesn't have the sharp V, the sharper V like the Peach 7 v does. It's more of a C. But the contour of it is, it's, it's just really good. And it's, for those that are interested, it's a little bit thicker neck. Yeah, but it's not, I won't consider a big neck. And especially up here, they've done a really good job where they've got some extra wood right in here in the, in the headstock. And I think that helps the tone of it. And maple neck, it's got 6,100 frets on it. So that's really interesting. They've got the big frets. And I, I love the big frets, the 6,100 frets. I, I love those better than 6,105s because 6,105 are, are tall and narrow. And the 6100, they're tall, but they're also wide. And, and I like that, it helps with the bends. And I, th I think it adds, it, I think it really looks good with the big frets myself. And I think it, it, makes it makes it play nice too. So, and the, the pickups are really good in this, this guitar. They are the uh, hand wound Texas Specials. And I've had the, Check for certain to see. Um, they're Abigail Yavar, but they're so modeled they on the original Abigail. guitar. They're not just out of a box. They, yeah. If you watch the video that comes with the guitar, they talk about how they took the original guitar and tried to model the sound. Did so you're model? not just buying a paint job, you're buying the sound also. Yeah, that, I, I've never had a strat that sounded the same as this one does. It's, it's kind of a, a, a unique sound. And it's also. Uh, sounds more like a, 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 a 59 strat would sound. So we'll give you a, a little bit of a listen to um, the sound of, gu of the guitar. And what are we playing through over here? Oh, that's a 67 uh, Park. And uh, that's two rock with a, a single 12. And it's one of my favorite amps. And we got a couple pedals here. And I got an OCD version two and a phase shifter. You don't have a button on it. I had, I had a phase shifter on. This is like a the old MS. Oh, I can't remember. MS MXR. Uh, MXR. And uh, what's here? From the eighties. So let's see. This I turned the phase shifter off. So let's. <laughs> Up. I'll go here with this pickup. To, I guess you call that the fourth position. Second position. 
Also, the same master builder that builds uh, the guitars for Eric Clapton. So uh, I think that makes it a special guitar too. And it's built by Todd Krause. He, Eric Clapton owned this guitar uh, after Stevie's passing. It came into Eric Clapton's hands some years after that. And then uh, the Guitar Center purchased the guitar. And that's when they made the replicas of it. But Tom Krause knowing Eric Clapton and uh, personally making his guitars, many of those he's had throughout the years, mm -hmm. I think that makes this a guitar, special guitar, and something that you can play uh, with enjoyment and, and all the tone that it, and the appointments that it possesses. <clears throat> so good luck to the bidders, and uh, thank you for watching.